Hey everybody, Quinn Lears, newhomesales.com. Check it out. In this episode, I'm gonna teach you how to get tens of thousands of dollars worth of sales training for free. How to become indisruptible, specialize, connect, brand, influence. Now check this out. During the downturn of uh, 2008, I was struggling because I needed sales training more than ever, but I just couldn't afford it. There just wasn't a lot of money. I wasn't even sure if I was going to make it in new home sales. So I came up with a clever way to get world-class sales training for free. I'm gonna share it with you right now. Now, if you remember last week, we talked about the importance of specializing. I said, if you wanna be terrific, you have to be specific. If you wanna get rich, you have to have a niche, or is it niche? Either way, point is, is that, that I believe that new home sales is a specialty that's unique, different, separate from, superior to general real estate, regular sales, and we should have a unique approach. One of the things that we need to become an expert in is the product that we represent. Now that's hard to do because a, a new home is very complex and there's a lot of different brands and products and um, components. So here's what I did. I contacted all of the different brands that were inside my home. So if you remember from last week, I said, I want you to go through and just write down every single brand. Now, here's the next phase. You contact Whirlpool, Maytag, GE, Moen, Kohler, Lennox, whoever your brand is going through, uh, whatever these brand names are, you contact them and you say, look, I need to know why we're using Whirlpool, why we're using Maytag, why we're using Kohler. And they have world-class sales trainers uh, they, you'll see them at the conventions, you'll see them at the trade shows. Uh, and they're not busy right now, trust me, because of the, the, the COVID. They will do a Zoom training, they will train your sales staff for free. That's how I kind of got, became an expert in my components of my homes. So you need to say, hey, why are we using Moen? Why are we using, from the doorknobs to the, to the, the air conditioner, to the, the tile brand, to the windows, to the door manufacturer. Um, I went to the, factory where our doors are made. I talked to the owner of the company and he gave me some outstanding um, ammunition, some sales and hey, look, let me show you why the doors that you use are superior. So your assignment this week is very simple. Contact the brands that you do business with and ask them to train your sales staff. All you sales managers out there, just set it up once a week, once a month, double every twice a, twice a month, something like that. Write me a thank you card because you're gonna get some great tips, you're going to realize that, holy cow, I had no idea that the windows did this, that the, the dishwasher did that. Here's a quick example. So we use, we use Maytag, Maytag dishwashers, okay? Maytag, it's ultra quiet, it's energy star, it's uh, full stainless on the inside, okay? This has, check this out, a high level shut off. So if you ever have water that gets a little bit too high, it will literally shut it off so it doesn't flood. This comes off for easy cleaning. See if you have any issues or if it gets clogged up, but it doesn't get clogged up because here's the exclusive feature. It actually has a garbage disposal built in to the dishwasher. So there's other things and tips that we're gonna do and tactics about how to present it. And there's more to even that dishwasher but that's your assignment for this week. So at least contact one of the brands. And then here's the last tip. Here's the thing. Use the brand names in your sales presentation. People want to be associated with brands, with top brands, with, and, and big companies that have spent millions and millions of dollars uh, to create brand recognition, right? So if a home is just a bunch of parts put together, you want to, to kind of hijack that brand or to leverage the power of that brand. So make sure you, you're using, that number one, that you know the brand, number two, that you know about the brand, the advantages of it, but that you're actually using the brand name in your presentation. That's it for this week. I hope you're enjoying these videos. If you know somebody in new home sales, guys, please share this video with them. We're gonna be coming up with some great stuff. Hope you're enjoying it and uh, stay safe out there. Keep on keeping on, my friends.